un turno, the side manager um, here turno. Thank you so much, Brooks, as well, for being here. Now, I will give them a chance to present themselves uh, in a minute. Uh, and before that, I was, uh, uh, I plan to just uh, basically uh, run a couple of housekeepings and um, uh, webinar structure, so you will know what to expect of this webinar. Uh, first of all, we cannot hear you, but we can see the chat. So uh, feel free to drop any questions you might have of this webinar. Uh, we will try to respond uh, as many as possible uh, in case we'll skip any uh, because of time constraint. We will definitely uh, respond in uh, tomorrow when we send the recording of this uh, webinar uh, via email. Um, if you cannot hear us, uh, it's probably because um, uh, the speaker might be uh, muted um, or the volume might be down, so just uh, turn it up. It happens to the best of us, so um, it's possible. And uh, yeah, as I was saying, the webinar recording will be sent out tomorrow and it will be as well uploaded on YouTube, so uh, it will always be there as a reference. About the, um, the structure of this webinar, I uh, will now, in a moment, have Brooks present himself. Uh, then uh, Marisa will uh, introduce uh, everybody to Logify, uh, and Brooks will take over again to explain uh, Turno and basically talk about the, the central topic of today's webinar. He will also do a, a demo. And then we will show how to integrate Logify and Turno, uh, which is very easy. We will show you. Uh, finally, we will talk about some strategies and tips, and uh, then we'll respond to all the questions that uh, that you might have. So here we are, Brooks. If you want to present yourself, now that'd be moment. great. I appreciate it. Hello, everyone. Uh, super excited to be here and present Turno to all of you. Thank you to Logify for uh, giving us this opportunity and to expand our partnership together. We've been great partners for a while, and it's a, it's a great opportunity to expand in this capacity. But uh, super excited to hear in a few slides to give, give you guys a breakdown of, of Turno and how we look to automate all the things in, regarding cleaning management. Um, and uh, and uh, I'm, I'm really excited for that. Perfect. Thank you so much, Brooks. So, uh, yes, Marisa, if you want to take the, this part to introduce Logify to who is not a, a customer of Logify. Sure, thank you. Um, just a quick intro, I'm Marisa. I'm the Director of Partnerships at Logify. And as part of my role, I manage our relations with our channel partners, as well as our marketplace partners. And we're really excited to have Brooks here today from Turno. Um, as he mentioned, we've been partners for a long time, very successful. And this is actually the first of our partner webinar series. So thanks, Brooks, for joining us. Um, and those of you that uh, might not be familiar with Logify, uh, just a quick intro to what we do. We're a vacation rental software, um, and we one of our um, values is to empower owners and property managers to be able to create their own bookable website and accept direct bookings. And you can manage all of your reservations, your guest communication, um, your calendar from all your connected channels in one centralized platform. And if you're interested in signing up, you can scan that QR code and it will take you to our sign up page where you'll be connected with a sales agent. And just a quick intro to our marketplace. Um, so we do have the marketplace in Logify where you can go to shop and connect your favorite apps. Uh, this will allow you to grow your tech stack and really um, optimize your business operations. Um, we have apps from various different categories, from short-term rental insurance, uh, guest experience, dynamic pricing, and what we're here to talk about today, cleaning and turnover management. And if you don't see an app on the marketplace that you want us to add, please leave us feedback. Uh, we check it every day and we'll work on getting it added for you. And without further ado, I'll hand it off to Brooks to give you a little intro on Turno. 
Awesome. Thank you very much. Hello again, everyone. Uh, thank you for joining us today, by the way. I'm, I'm Brooks once again, and I'm thrilled to be here uh, with you all to talk about Turno. Uh, whether you're a seasoned short terminal pro or just starting out, we have some exciting insights and tools to share that will help streamline your short terminal cleaning management processes and enhance your guest experiences. Um, before we dive in, I want to extend a big thank you to Logify uh, for this fantastic opportunity to introduce Turno to their wonderful user base. Turno and Logify have been partnered together for, for a while now, and it's it's been truly a great partnership. We've enjoyed collaborating together, growing together, and uh, we always aim to provide the best possible solutions for, uh, for all of you. Um, at Turno, we're all about making your life easier. From, cleaning, from cleaner onboarding to efficient recruitment for cleaners. Today, we're diving into how Turno can integrate seamlessly with Logify to boost your operations and keep everything running smoothly. So grab your favorite beverage, get comfortable, and let's uh, let's explore how Turno can revolution, revolutionize your, your cleaning management workflows. We're excited to have you with us on this journey together towards greater efficiency and success. So let's get started. As you guys all know, or we'll go back to the last slide, sorry. As you guys all know, cleanliness is incredibly important, um, especially when you're getting started out or expanding into new mar markets or bringing on a new short term rental into your portfolio, a bad review can, can be killer. Um, so our whole goal here at Turno is to help source reliable cleaners that you can trust and build long-term relationships with. And then in addition to that, automate away all the headache of cleaning management. That's the whole goal here. And so we have two kind of two kind of uh, major aspects of our product. We have the Turno Marketplace, which you can see on the screen right now, which is helps you source cleaners, whether that's finding new primary cleaners, finding new backup cleaners, finding cleaners as you expand into new markets um, or add short terminals to your portfolio. The Turno Marketplace can be a great place for that. You, to find very reliable, trustworthy uh, cleaning partners, that relationship will last for a long time is the goal. We also have the actual cleaning management software portion of it. So in that cleaning management software, we're gonna automate and smooth out the whole process when it comes to cleaning management, make sure nothing falls through the cracks. And our software will make it so it's incredibly hands-off for you. After the initial onboarding and configurations and you make the kind of tweaks to make it personalized to your business, it becomes super easy and self-sufficient. Turno at, at that point will um, uh, really become hands-off. Fantastic. So automate with Turno software. The kind of a, a lot of the ways we're achieving this hands-off approach to cleaning management is through automated cleaner payments. So whether it's your own cleaner or one of our own marketplace cleaners, we're gonna completely take away the headache of cleaning payments, or sorry, paying out cleaners. Um, and you'll be able to distribute those funds automatically whenever they clean, uh, finish those projects for you. We're also gonna provide checklists um, and you can build your own checklist within Turno. So that way, no matter who is cleaning your property, whether it's a primary cleaner, a backup cleaner, or a new cleaner, they're going to have that checklist. So you can have that quality control. And then you can make sure that they go through the checklist on the Turno app. Um, so we have two apps, one for the host and one for the cleaner. And on that cleaner side is where they'll be able to go through that checklist. Also do problem reporting. So if they have a report, any damages to the unit or missing items, anything along those lines, they can report that there with commentary and photos. They'll even do inventory management and they'll track where uh, the track the status of the items you wish for them to track in, in the inventory management portion of Turno. So for example, if you, wanna, if you want them to report on, on uh, how are the coffee pods looking or how's the toilet paper looking, they'll be able to do that as well. We also have 24 seven customer support. So at any time in the day, you can reach out to our chat, live chat support and get a hold of somebody if you ever have any issues. Fantastic. So in addition to all of that cleaning management automa auto automation that we provide in all of those streamlined processes, we have the world's largest cleaner marketplace. We have over 55,000 global cleaners that have completed close to 5 million projects in our system. Projects is the word we, we often use for cleans or turns. Um, and so 
these cleaners have go through a vetting process when they when they onboard with Turno. They have to verify that they've cleaned at least short, three short-term rentals. And then it usually takes a few weeks to, to process and make sure that they're a good fit for the marketplace. And after they go through that vetting process, they get the green light to join our marketplace. And then after that, the way we can we consistently make sure that there's quality control with these cleaners is all the hosts have the option to review all of these cleaners. So in the system, I'll show you where that is here in a second, but whenever you are looking for cleaners in your market, you'll put out that cleaner search and you'll be able to see their profiles. You'll be able to see um, all the cleans that they've done recently. You'll be able to see um, all the reviews from all the different hosts that have used their services in the area. Awesome. What we're also going to provide is, an, is a direct integration with Logify, and we'll speak to that here in a sec about how we establish that connection. But um, we'll integrate with Logify, and what that provides is a direct feed. So all of your reservations will pull from Logify into Turno, so that way those reservations come into the Turno centralized calendar. Turno then creates certain cleans based off of the configurations you set for that reservation. Most likely it's probably, you know, right after checkout or whatever configurations you set. And so Turner will automatically create that task. And then it automatically sends a notification to the primary cleaner of that property, prompting them to accept the clean. So that way you don't have to worry about that distribution at all. They'll accept that clean. And then when the time comes, they'll have all the access to the data they would need to access the property and have a successful clean like the checklist photo expectations, the inventory, all that stuff. Perfect, so now I'd like to transition into the, into the software here. Gave everyone kind of a general idea of the UI and uh, how everything functions. Perfect, Brooks, I will stop share the screen. So I will give you the chance to share yours. Perfect, thank you. All right, and now we can see it. Perfect. Fantastic. So this is Turno. As you can see over here on this left-hand side, we divide the different sections of the tool pretty so in, in kind of a self-explanatory way. You know, the dashboard's the dasher, dashboard, cleaner search is the cleaner search, and it continues on to there in a very self-explanatory way, very easy to navigate based off the feedback we get from our user base. Up here in the top right corner, is where you'll be able to chat with all of your cleaners by clicking that little chat function and then it opens up that chat box. Well, also in the top right hand corner, this is where you'll get into a lot of the customizations and settings that you can configure to be a little bit more tailored towards your cleaning management operation. Make sure it's a you know the right fit. Um, we we'll probably won't go too deep into that today, but just so you know, it'd be right here where it says your initials um, and then you have a lot of different settings and configurations that can be done there. So on this left-hand side, the first landing page is going to be the dashboard. In this dashboard, it's a great way to see a bird's eye view into the day-to-day -day of your cleaning management. Now, like I mentioned before, after the initial setup, Turno becomes very self-sufficient. You probably really won't have to come into the tool very often, but the dashboard can be a good place for you to check on things and just kind of see how the day looks and how the, the future week is. So as of today, I don't have any cleans, but over the next seven days, I have 13. It'll give me quick highlights there. It'll also, also show me projects or turns, as, as we call them projects uh, often, require uh, my attention because there's no cleaner assigned yet. So maybe the cleaner hasn't accepted the clean yet, or I need to, maybe it's a new property and I need to assign a prop, uh, cleaner to that property. Then we have the problems tab, and these are reports coming from the cleaners. So they updated um, a broken share and, and sent me uh, an image of it so I can keep track of it and resolve that issue on the property. And then at the bottom, I can also keep track of my cleaner search, which is a, a good transition. So let's, let's take a look at the cleaner search. Th this tool is great. It helps a ton of people every single day. All day, every day, we get requests and people creating new marketplace searches to try and find new cleaners. Like I said, whether, whether they're trying to find their first cleaner or they're trying to expand into new markets, find backup cleaners, or even 
sometimes replace the cleaners they have today. Um, so I have an open search here for San Diego created six days ago. I have 10 bids. What I'm going to do is I'm going to walk through the process of a new search. So I would choose which property this would be applicable for. And let's do, let's do this one. If we'd hit next and then it's going to pull this information, most of this information from Logify, uh, but you can tweak it if needed, but it'll have square footage. Bedroom, bathroom count, address. Don't worry, the cleaners will not see your address in this in this process until they actually become one of your long-term cleaners. And then you can describe your cleaning needs. Whether you know how many how many turns do you expect per month? And let's say, oh, well, we usually have every weekend plus a few more, so we'll say like six. How long does it take to clean your unit? Uh, it takes me about two and a half hours. And then you have some specifications you can. You can fill out, these are all pre-checked. Our, our cleaners are used to these process, processes by default, but you can tweak them however you need to. And then if there's any like special requirements for your property, maybe you have something specific, like, you know, I'd also like my cleaner to clean the jacuzzi, then I could add that there. And I'd hit the find cleaners button. Boom, congrats, we did it, put in the search. And there we go. We actually already have three bids. So this is from our cleaner search and we'll continue to get a lot of bids over the next, I don't know, 72 hours, I would say. What is where you'll see a, most of them in the first 24 hours. Uh, but we have one from Carolina, Nathaniel, Alexis. You're gonna see all of them are background checked. They all went through that vetting process, but some cleaners and cleaning companies on our system will have additional qualifications like additional licensing, bonding from the local municipality, uh, liability insurance as well. So if they meet those qualifications internally, we can give them that badge. When I click in, I can see information about the cleaner. I can see, sorry, what, uh, I can see how many projects they've done through Turner or how many turns. So Nathaniel has done over 360. Uh, he's about 24 miles away in Fort Lauderdale. And I can see the message he sent over, his bio, and then the reviews. 15 five-star, one four-star, one three-star, and then I can actually click through those. And like I said earlier, these reviews are from other hosts just like yourself that have used his services on Turno before. So these are directly from the source. Other hosts have used them for their short terminals. And so very solid uh, reviews, and then I can click through them. And so that's the flow. If I feel like they have the potential of being a good fit, I can accept bid and add to my team and then um, that doesn't lock you in anything. It doesn't charge you anything. It just opens up communication further with that cleaner. So you can determine if they're gonna be a long-term fit. You can do expectation setting, pricing negotiation. You can even schedule an in-person walkthrough um, just to make sure that they're you know, the right fit for the team. And then that's the flow. After you accept them, they're gonna come here into the My Team tab. And by default, they're not gonna start being integrated into the automation until you assign them as a primary or a backup cleaner. And like I mentioned earlier in the calendar view, Turno is going to be able to get all of your reservations from Logify. As soon as that reservation comes in, it's going to create a cleaning task based off of the configurations you set, usually on the tail end of that reservation. And then it's going to send the notification to your primary cleaner prompting them to accept it and you're good to go. That whole process is completely automated for you. And so this is the calendar view. You'll see the reservations being pulled in here. Uh, great way to stay organized in it's completely automated fashion. In the projects tab, we also have the list view, just another way, another way to digest the data or digest all the pro, you know, all the, all the future cleans you have here in the list view. We also have some reporting. So if you're using your own cleaners or just want to report on some general data, you can report here and you can see, oh, how much did we pay out on, on X, Y, and Z units over this amount of time to these cleaners? Run the report and it'll save it for you down here if you need to make a recurring report. As I mentioned earlier, the cleaners in their cleaner app are going to have access to your checklist, to your 
um, um, inventory as well. If they ever notice any issues, that's going to come here into the problems tab. Any inventory related concerns or also damaged items. So here I have a report from one of my cleaners, broken chair, sent a photo, and then me as the host, I can manage that however needed. And if I click down here a little bit, I'm actually going to skip down. Let's take a look at the checklists. So in the popular checklist tab, this is an easy way for everyone to get started. So if you're not working with checklist today, it's no stress. Um, you can come into the popular checklist tab and these are commonly shared checklists across Turno users. So you can click into the one, one of these, see if it kind of fits the general vibe that you're looking for on your checklist. <clears throat> and then all you'd have to do is hit this button right here, add to my checklists, and then it's gonna move it to my checklist where the, you can then edit, add and remove whatever you need to to make it more tailored for, for your unit. Um, like I mentioned earlier, you can add photo expectations to these checklists and you can also require photos. And it will make it so in the cleaner app that they have to take the photo as well. It's not something they can upload from their photo library. And so that's the flow with the checklist. In line with that is the inventory. So be able to track inventory and assign it to different properties. And so you can have the cleaners keep track of basically kind of whatever you want to when it comes to inventory in the unit. And you can either track it as precisely or an estimate. Precise means that they're going to actually give you a number like, oh, there's eight coffee pods left, right? And then the estimate is more like, oh, the coffee pods are looking low or they're a below average. And then that way, however you prefer, you can keep track of that and then easily uh, resolve those needs as needed. Perfect. This is the properties tab I want to highlight. This is going to pull all of your property data from Logify when you create the integration. So all good there, no problem. Um, but it's also, when you click in, a great way to do configurations and settings. So you'll click through here, connect Logify, can personalize some check-in and check-out, checklist, inventory, um, which teammates are assigned to my unit, and then also payments. Every single one of your property can have its own payment set up. Um, and the payments can happen, will happen automatically if you use our cleaner from our marketplace. Um, if you use your own cleaners and onboard them onto Turno uh, for your own team specifically, you can also set up auto payments. And auto payments is a way for you to uh, automatically pay them out whenever they complete a project for you as well. Super beneficial, super, help, super helpful. We also provide 1099s to all of these cleaners at the end of the year, whether they're a marketplace cleaner or a cleaner you're already working with that you onboarded onto your Turno account, we're gonna provide the 1099, um, which will save some time at the end of the year as well. Fantastic, we also have the manual payments module. That's gonna allow you to, you know, if a card ever declines or maybe you just wanna send a little tip to the cleaner for doing a great job, you can punch in that manual payment and send it over. Fantastic. And really the last thing I wanted to highlight here would be the quality center. And this is a great way for quality control. Now, I, I'm not an active host, so I don't have Airbnb integrated here, but I would recommend in addition to integrating Logify would be to integrate Airbnb. And what this does is it's going to pull in all of your, um, all of the cleaners that you're working with, recent Airbnb reviews for you to track their progress and do some quality control, make sure they're doing a great consistent five-star job uh, for your business because we all know how important that is. Fantastic. Got it. So that is, that is what I had prepared for today um, for the Turno demo. Like I said, there's a lot more configurations and settings, a little bit more nitty gritty that you can get down into. Um, but in terms of keeping it short, sweet, and simple, um, I hope you guys were able to see the level of automation, simplicity uh, we're able to provide here at Turno for you guys. Amazing. Thank you so much, Brooks. It was, uh, it was a great demo. I think that uh, our customers and everybody here have uh, uh, taken a lot of value in, in your demo. Thanks a lot. Now let's continue with uh, the quick steps on how to simply integrate Turno and Logify. I will show you how to do it. 
let me know if you can see again the screen. Should come in a second. All right, perfect. So yes, the integration. Well, first of all, what does it mean to know for the users that are already in Logify? Uh, there are two big things uh, that will part over from uh, Logify to Turno when importing. And these are the rentals and the reservations. So in this way, you will have all everything you need uh, to manage and automate your clean tasks already in, uh, in Turno after the, the integration. But how does it happen? It's very simple. In Logify, uh, the only thing that basically you need to retrieve is the API key. The API key can be found either in the settings, and there is a, a little public API section with the key, uh, or you can just go in the marketplace and then click Turno. In the steps on how to connect, you will see the, the same API key in there, which is a string of numbers and letters, uh, which you can copy and then um, paste in, in Turno. In Turno, also, it's uh, it's very simple on how, how to connect it. You'll just need to go on the top right where you'll see the um, uh, integrations tab when you click on the profile picture. Uh, you will find amongst the, the PMS is uh, available Logify. So you'll click the connect in there. And then um, once you retrieve the, the API key in either of the two ways that uh, I was saying a moment ago, uh, here we have a screenshot on on the other way, so to go to settings and then public API, you just copy the, the key and in Turno, you just basically paste it there. Uh, here, you will basically able to um, select the listings from Logify and yeah, that's, uh, that's really it. You click on update and everything will be imported in, in Turno. So, now, Brooks, I know that you have prepared a couple of uh, strategies and tips here to uh, to really get more value from from the Turno software. Hundred <clears throat> percent. And one of the ones we like to reiterate to all of our partners is to make sure you have some backup cleaners. You know, great primaries are awesome, and obviously the, they're going to do the bulk load of those turns for you, but. What, you know, when they go on vacation or something comes up, you want to make sure you have those backup cleaners in place to make sure nothing falls through the cracks. And that's where Turno has a lot of value as well. So I know for a lot of you, you probably have existing cleaners you're using today. Feel free to invite them in the My Team Met tab into your Turno account only um, as the primary cleaner. And then you could use our marketplace for some backup cleaners just to make sure nothing falls through the cracks, 100%. Now, when you're using our marketplace, uh, to find cleaners. One of the biggest tips we do is make sure to accept as many bids as you want. It doesn't lock you in anything. It doesn't charge you anything. It just opens up communication with those cleaners for you to actually kind of vet them, you know, do some questions, do an interview, make sure that you're setting all those expectations up front with the, with the new cleaners and making sure uh, they're a good fit. And then, um, our auto pay function. So for those of you that have your own cleaners and wish to invite, invite them onto Turno, please take advantage of auto pay. It's going to be um, really efficient. It's also going to provide you that 1099 at the end of the year. And then the payment processing rates are very low. Um, it's, 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 uh, it's a great product for sure. Perfect. Thank you so much for these extra extra tips from your side. That uh, I'm sure it will be it, it will be really amazing to to know when actually put in the hands and and start scheduling and using the the platform. Uh, I wanted to add as well um, that thanks to our partnership, we have um, basically the ultimate Logify users that can use Turno for free. So. If you have an ultimate subscription or if you upgrade and get an ultimate subscription, um, you will also have a free account with Turno, uh, integrating the way that, uh, that we just saw. So I think that's, uh, that's something really handy to, to know. Now we have, uh, before the, the Q&A 
the space that we have reserved for this webinar. Um, I have also prepared a couple of questions here for the um, for Brooks uh, that basically are amongst the top ones from the from the customers. Um, and so here specifically we have will cleaners be notified when tasks are created or upon bookings? I think you already mentioned this in in your demo, Brooks. But if you want to uh, yeah, cover a little, little bit more, yeah, hundred percent. So. There are some kind of configurations to this to make it more tailored to your um, your business model. However, the default answer is as soon as it's really both, right? So the booking is going to come in from Logify automatically, very quickly, and then Turno is going to immediately create a task, cleaning task for that booking, and then your cleaner will be notified. Um, so really, it's when the task is created. Uh, but like I said, due to the direct API integration with Logify. It's all going to happen super fast. Now, if you want to delay for whatever reason, when the cleaner is able to accept that clean, you can, and you can kind of configure and make it a little bit more personalized. But yes, as soon as that task is created automatically with Interno upon the reservation arriving, you're good to go. Great. Thank you for, for clarifying this. And the second one that, uh, that we have is, do I have to create a cleaner search for every cleaning I need or can I create a long-term relationship with the Turno cleaners? That's a great question. And one we get fairly often. Um, so the whole goal with our cleaner search is to help you find one, you know, help you find long-term cleaners that are a good fit for your operation and that you can create that long-term relationship with. Um, it's not meant to be something that you have to do all the time, you know, filling in gaps and trying to find cleaners here and there. That is not the goal. The goal is to help you find really solid primary and backup cleaners that fit your business needs and you can build that long-term relationship with. Amazing. Perfect. All right. Now we have reached the Q&A session. Let's see which of the questions we have here. I saw a couple in the, in the dedicated section here in the webinar. All right. Let's see. We also have a way to put them on the screen here. My cleaner is on Turno. I don't want any other cleaner. How can I assure it's the same cleaner? Sure. So in this case, I assume I assume that your cleaner is on our marketplace, but you're not currently using Turno. So hopefully I'm understanding that, that question correctly. Um, in that case, what you can do is create an Eterno account, simply invite uh, if you have that cleaner's email you, or phone number, you can send them an invitation and invite them onto your um, your team, and then they would be your own designated cleaner. All right. Then the next one is, let me put it here on the screen. Will the primary uh, be able cleaner, I imagine, be able to see other cleaners should they not accept the bid? Sure. Um, Will the, will the primary be able to see other cleaners? Should the primary not accept the bed? Maybe referring to the backups here in the first part, will the backups be able to see other cleaners? Should the primary not accept the bid? Um, correct. So whenever that cleaning task is correct is created, if the primary cleaner ever rejects that clean for whatever reason, maybe they're out of town or double booked or busy, then it'll open it up automatically to your backup cleaners. So usually we recommend having two or three and they'll be able to fill in the cracks there. So that's the flow. And like I said, it's that's also hands off and automated. So if the primary ever says no to an, uh, a new cleaning request, you're good to go because your backups are going to be there to then uh, pick up the slack. Perfect. All right. Then the next one we have in the list is can you exclude properties from the property list in Turno if you have if you use a local cleaner who is not on Turno? Yeah, so when you import those listings, totally you can you can delete them and and remove them however you need to. Um, if you have a local cleaner who is not on Turno, that's totally fine. Feel free to invite them onto our system. In fact, a ton of our users 
are using their own cleaners. In most cases, it's a mix. They're using their own cleaners that they already had a relationship with, and they're also using our marketplace cleaners. Um, so all you'd have to do is go into the My Team tab, hit the Invite Teammate button, and it's going to send them a text message or an email prompting them to uh, accept your account. And then they'll download the Turnover for Cleaners app. Very small learning curve there, by the way. Very easy to use. Not a, you know We have over 55,000 uh, cleaners that have been able to implement that app very efficiently. Um, so you would just simply invite them on and then they can take you can take advantage of all the automation that Turno provides with your existing cleaner. That's great. And let's see the next one. I think this was already responded. Will the primary be able to see other cleaners? Should the primary not accept the bid? Yeah. So this might have been a duplicate. I'll skip to the other one. I'm a Turno part of Logify. Um, I assume it's if it's Turno, it's part of Logify. Uh, no, they are two two different two different softwares. Um, we in fact we are we're collaborating today uh, to bring more awareness of one another uh, and how Logify users can. Uh, take advantage of the solutions of Turno to automate, uh, automate their uh, cleaning operations in short-term rental and as well for Turno users on how they can take advantage of uh, a solution like Logify. Um, if see. I can just uh, add something sure. here. While they are two separate softwares, um, they connect with each other, right? So you, but when you integrate, you take your API key from Logify and you put it into Turno. And what that does is it automatically creates your properties in Turno, so you don't have to go through and create that all manually. And it takes all of your bookings from Logify, from all of your connected channels and your direct booking website, and it automatically imports it into Turno. So Turno has a live feed of all your information. And from Turno, you can set your booking or your cleaning settings. So if you want a cleaner to go in every you know, day after a checkout, you can set that up automatically. So you don't have to be there manually texting your cleaner, figuring out when someone's checking in or checking out, making sure that the property is clean. So this is how it really, that integration helps automate your, your business. Yeah, perfect. Thank you for the, the addition, Marisa. And here, next up we have, if we already have Turno and have one property, can I still add Turno to Logify without upgrading? Yeah, 100%. So uh, Turno for one property is always free of, of a subscription. So no subscription required if it's only one property to use your own cleaners. So you're, you're good to go. Yeah, and on the Logify side, uh, you can use Turno regardless of how many properties you have. So there's no limitations there. Exactly, exactly. And then let's see, next one. Actually, I am trying to find out if the prim primary cleaner rejects. Can the primary see who accepts the cleaning? They cannot. They cannot see which backup picks up the role or the job, sorry. They also, when it comes to our cleaner marketplace, you're going to get a all those different bids from prospective cleaners in your market. Um, they're not going to they're not going to see each other there. They're not going to see which one you end up assigning to the property either. Um, so they, the primary will not see that, that information. Perfect. Perfect. Next one. I want to know if the cleaners can see each other decision in the schedule. I think that was a continuation of the, of the last one. All good. Uh, they're not going to see that information. Only, only you will. <laughs> right. Okay, and then, ah, uh, yes. Oh, we just got an, just got another one. Um, is Turno just, free? Just, just to clarify. Just, yeah. yeah, just to clarify, um, there is no Turno subscription 
for using your own cleaners in Turno if you are on the Logify Ultimate plan. Also, if you only have one property and use your own cleaners, there is no subscription there either. Hope that helps. Let's see, I'm looking if uh, we have more. Yeah, there's a couple more questions in the chat. I just, I'm not able to pin them over to the Q&A section. No worries, no worries. You can review them. Yeah. Okay. One is, I'll put it on the screen from Christy. Can I have two primary cleaners per property? I don't want the cleaner to know they are backup. That's totally fine. And actually, if you assign someone as a backup, they don't actually know they're a backup. So there's no problem there either. Uh, but yes, you can assign as many primaries as you want, as many backups as you want. It would basically just become first come, first serve. Uh, so if you had like two primary cleaners, whenever that task is created and the notification is accepted, or sorry, sent, it's basically whoever would accept it first would be the one that ends up cleaning the property. Um, but just to make it a little simpler, feel free to assign them as a backup. They're not going to know. They'll just get occasional cleaning requests whenever the backup is needed. Perfect. Okay. And then this is specific from me, I think. Do you have laundry only? Um, so the cleaners are used to doing laundry in their processes. In fact, it, when I was showing you the cleaner search, it's one of the default selected options. Now you can remove that if you need to. If there are ad additional specific requirements beyond laundry, you can specify that. And then you can open up conversations after you get the bids with the cleaners to see you know, what they would be comfortable with and do some expectation setting and interviewing there. Um, so like, for example, in my, you know, if you needed them to also clean the jacuzzi or whatever it may be, you just send them a note and say, hey, are you comfortable doing this? If so, what would, you know, you can negotiate a new rate potentially and, and make it work. All right. Let's see. I see a couple of more here. Do you have cleaners in Costa Rica? Another specific one from Jessica. Um, in Costa Rica, it's definitely going to be a smaller market. Uh, but what I can do is I can follow up with you directly, Jessica. Um, we, sh we should have your information here from the registrar's list. So I'll reach out to you specifically and I'll let you know how many cleaners we have in your market. Amazing. Justin asks, what's the benefit of using Turno if we already have a system that works? Maybe you want to share something that um, Turno offers extra, you know, extra cool. features. Good question. So, you know, in this situation where you already have a system in place, um, the system might work, but it's, you know, I, there's a certain philosophy when it comes to management and running a business where it's management by exception where you want to try and automate as much as you can and trust technology to take it to the next level for you. So sometimes we might have a system that already works in place for us, and that's great, and that's fantastic, but why not take advantage of what's available to us in terms of additional functionality, additional automation, so that way we can focus as hosts, we can focus more on revenue generating activities rather than you know assigning certain tasks or you know, filling in the gaps on the cleaning management side of things. Let's let's focus on getting more owners, uh, expanding into new markets, growing the business. Perfect. Okay, and uh, I see the last one here from Mark. So for three properties using both your own cleaners and turnos is $72 per year total. So for three properties using both your own cleaners and turn out for three properties, um, potentially the, the, that might be right. Let me do some quick math in my head. So if you're not on the, if you're not on the ultimate plan, uh, just so everyone knows, our turnout pricing is pretty straightforward. It's going to be 
$8 per property per month or $6 per property per month if you pay yearly. So let me do some math. So if you pay yearly, which is $6, six times 12, it would be, it would be 72 per property. That's correct. All right. Perfect. I think that we don't have more questions. I was monitoring the chat. So, yeah, I think uh, if you don't have any more, ah, actually, maybe just one came right now. Let me see. I will pin it as well. What about one property that can be rented per unit or as a whole house? Great question. So we support lock-off functionality. It's not a problem. We have lots of users that are using a similar, uh, a similar business model. Uh, it would work the same way. We would just have them separated as different listings. And then um, those, whenever those reservations come in from Logify, the same methodology will happen on Turno's end when it comes to, you know, assigning that cleaner and sending it the notification to clean the property for you. All right. Perfect. I don't see any more questions. So perfect. I will, uh, I will once again, thank you, Marisa and, and Brooks for being here for the, for this webinar. I think it was really interesting uh, to chat with you on the topic. For the recording, as I said, uh, I will be uh, sending it out uh, tomorrow by the end of the week uh, at most, and it will be as well on YouTube. So, yes, thanks a lot again for being here, everybody as well, and we'll see you in the next webinar. Have a nice rest of your night. Thanks, everyone. Bye, everyone. Thanks. Bye. Thanks for joining. Bye-bye.